Not so much, but I don't mess around. I know it's good, but it's not good. Like I, I that means I won't have the. I will like when I'm talk, when I'm talking to my kids about uh, stories. I won't be like I won't have anything interesting. And everything you see, you must talk. Some things you hear and deaf, see I'm blind. It changes. So the the for very first day or not the very first day, the day before you do your work, you have to write your goals. Goals. Uh, you have to write your goals, and so if for English, you'd write the page that you're on to the page you're gonna finish, and maths so on, and you keep doing that. Um, then you can't if you don't finish your goals, then you don't finish your work. So you could be up until like 11 o'clock doing your goals if you set, if you get too cocky thinking you can do a uh, different amount of pages, let's say you want to do 35 pages of this, 5 pages of another and then yeah that would take quite a while. Hi guys, um, I've, I'm on my way to see my cousin now, I've just finished reading my book, I look so fat, <laughs> I look so fat, but yes, we are on our way, my mum told me to record, I don't know what to record. I decided to go back to school because I um, wanted to get back in touch with my old friends, and but I wasn't I wasn't too sure if I wanted to go back to school because I don't know if I get like in trouble a lot um, or like what would happen. Um, but then my mum, my mum told me that that like, she just came home one day and said you're going to school. I was like, you're joking. And then she um, she pulled out a uniform. I was like, thanks. And then yeah, and I started. Um, at first, I walked past the door. I had a hat on. Uh, no one, no one recognized me until I took my like until after. Then all I remember was um, everyone was crowding around me. Like, is that Tiago? Is that Tiago? Tiago. It's Tiago, and then I and then I was just being crowned. Why were they doing that though? Um, because I was, I was that was the same primary school I left in year like the end of year two, so everyone still remembered me. Um, so they were excited that I was back. I can't. Everyone was so tall. Like they're short now, but they were really tall. Was it a nice experience going yeah. back? Yeah. Is that like the Tagamo? No. <laughs> was it a nice experience going back to school? Yeah. Yeah. But then if you remember that when you were there, you kept saying that you wanted to come back home. Why was that? Teachers. What did you find? What um, well, most of the teachers liked me, but then there was this one teacher that wasn't too sure of me at first because she was always like on my case. So I'd be, I'd be sewing 
and then I might sew my name uh, and then she, she would like yell at me for doing it when I'm not meant to do it right now because I, I would hear okay so what we're gonna do we're gonna sew your name you're gonna sew a little pattern and then I'd sew my name before I sew the um, so I've sewn my pattern and then I'd get yelled at so then I wasn't sure why but then there were some teachers that were there before when I was at school so they recognized me and they were nice yeah yeah uh, it, dep it depends how they are like um, how their personality is like but I would say go back to school sometime like if if you haven't been before I'd say it'd be a nice experience and if you haven't been in a while unless you got bullied and you had like a bad experience um, I, to be honest I it, I knew it wasn't all for friends but I knew that I was going back to school because of friends so it was in between it was more um, I want it was nice to see my friends but I was still there to study Okay. And how do you think the study, the studying was at school compared to what it was like at home? It was Did you learn different. more? Did you learn less? Um, is well, it was like, it was more of a recap. Wait, so I um, I went there higher than I was like, my, but my work when I was homeschooled was higher, um, like a year higher, a couple months higher than they, what they were teaching at school. So then we were just recapping and what I noticed was when I came back to homeschooling, I was behind on my work. Okay. Yeah, so tell us a bit more about the writing. Why is the writing more at home? I'm um, sorry, at school than it is at home. What did you why did you find that? Um because they do it's a type of work they uh, do. Hi, my name's Tiago. I just came back from my cousins. Uh I just met with my cousins and I just came back. So that's why I still have my jacket on and I just had my, I just took my bag off. Um, I'm amazing, I'm amazing, and I'm amazing. Okay, I'm gonna give you a quote. Laugh with many, but don't trust any. Because there'll be friends that are there. Because there'll be friends that are there to, like, bring you down. They'll see. They they'll want you to be happy for them, but they won't be happy for you. So let's say they got hundred pounds, and then they'll be like, "Oh yeah, I got hundred pounds. I oh, watch. I'm gonna go JD." They won't even. But they might buy you like a drink for a pound or something. But then if you find if you like get five hundred pound and you wanna go like spend it on family and stuff, um. They'll just look down on you and put behind your back. So nowadays, mom, they are called snakes. I don't know if they were called snakes before, but or an op. Um, socialization would mean like to go, to connect with different people. Um, like if if even if it was like two two or even a person, and then that one person would introduce you to more people, maybe a family member, a friend that's like a family member, friends. Um, and then you're socializing, you're out, um, you're connecting with other people. It all depends because if you go to school, some people, as you know, they get bullied. Maybe your child's getting bullied, like maybe not. Um, maybe they are the bullies. But uh, so some people they will twist other pe um, pe people's minds. So all it takes is one person to say, "Oh, uh, his hair looks weird. Like my hair's a mess right now because I just came back." But oh, his hair's weird. And then he will say it to one person, then that person will say it to another person, and then it will just go all around, and then they will uh, mock you for your how your hair looks. Like so, it all depends, um, like how you are, your personality, if you're like fun to be around or not. No, 
at all. Look, um, it depends if you're. It all is always depends. Like with me, especially like if I'm really if I'm in a mood to eat, I will eat three full stacks of ribs. If I'm not in a mood to eat, I'll probably eat like half a, a stack of ribs. Like that's just an example. So with me, you'll get a lot of. It depends. So. It depends if you don't like being around people, like if you're introverted. Um, like if you're the one that will stay, if you see a piano, you will stay around in the corner just playing the piano. Um, and people, like if, even if you're like really good at the piano, people will automatically come to the sound because they like it. In the middle. Because um, I'm... I'm just like I socialize with people at school and people with um homeschool so it's always like stuck there. I have quite a bit of friends, but in other people's cases, like if you're seeing someone constantly every day, then like even my brothers and my sisters we get into arguments just because of that. Uh, if you're seeing someone for every like every <laughs> single day, um, then like you tend to get annoyed at them at certain things that they do, and like that's when people talk behind people's backs say oh you're so annoying sometimes it only lasts for like a week couple of weeks couple of days it's like there's some occasions where it can happen for like a couple of years i've done athletics um i've done athletics i've done stitching i've been to a, a teach camp that's like a camp for uh people that do the same curriculum as me you go i'll be going to esc that means European student convention um yeah in July I think we're going so I think there's gonna this is my first time going so I'm not sure what it's gonna be like but I think it's gonna uh, there's like activities basketball um wood uh like wood making woodworks um art volleyball so there's a variety of choices that you can choose mm -hmm. Um, yeah, I went to PGL, I did like, there wasn't really much sports, there was a football that I did, there was netball that I was forced to do with my, my friends, since I played basketball, so I was like, sh I, they would pass to me and I'd chew it. Um, nope. When I first joined um, school, I'm going to go way back, when I first joined, uh, or joined back to school, Every, everything was so robotic, like it was all grey, if you know what I mean, like London never looked so grey And uh, it was like, thank you, they do little prayers, like, but it, it was like, they were forced to do it So they will be like, thank you God for school today Thank like all robotic, and then I I've, I've, I'm, I personally think I livened it up a little bit And like in assemblies, like they started like talking, having fun um, I've had good experiences. Um, the uh, I've, yeah, I've had good experiences because uh, me and my friends, it's like a competition to show who's better. Of course, I'm better. <laughs> uh, the big one that we went to, I didn't know much people there. A small one, it wasn't like. Um, it wasn't as good like they didn't think of much as activities they did they tried but uh, maybe it's because I was younger and they thought oh let's put them in the um, because I was really small probably like I, I was always one of the smallest but they probably put me in a lower group for that reason better when I'm in school um, so yeah I get like that because when when you go at school, some people I know they will wake up at like six o'clock, and um, they will call me because they're bored. So then I'm trying not to be loud because my mom and my stepdad, like everyone in my house, is probably sleeping. So then it's very hard because I feel like I might get in trouble for someone calling me at six o'clock in the morning. Oh yeah, but like they wake up at six o'clock, have their food, maybe go to like a breakfast club. Um, but yeah. And now that I'm homeschooled, I can wake up at like 8 to like 8.30. Because with luncheons, we get like eggs, bacon, bagels, beans. Mm.
um, in between. Work is um, home, with home schooling. Sometimes, if I do enough work, if my um, my mom's proud of you, I can go on the games, uh, the PS4, uh, or I can go to like the park, bring a basketball, practice. Whereas, like, so what I've seen, like, because I I haven't been to high school, so I haven't like when I was in primary school, there was no basketball hoop, so it wasn't as good, but it was decent since there was quite a bit more people. So I can play football or like play, kind of play basketball in a netball hoop. With school, you have to, you can't um, like go into, I don't think you can take off your blazer. And what if it's like a really hot day? Or uh, I've had some, I've heard some stories about how some teachers, they don't let them take off their blazer when it's burning hot, but then they, um, they have to keep their, blazer on they have to take off their blazer when it's cold so that doesn't i never had a problem with teachers because most teachers like me and they could tell um that there's no need to get come across as aggressive um in the middle, because we like just do experiments. Well, I remember in year six, we did some cool light experiments. That was fun. Um, is I, I, I'm not going to lie, I get lazy. And like, you need to do a lot more writing in school than you need to do uh, when you're homeschooled. It depends what curriculum you're doing. Uh, well, it's always in the middle, well, with those it's in the middle actually. Cause like I had a good maths teacher, so he helped quite a bit. Um, but my, my mom helps a lot as well. Um, it's like we could do black history um do lots of cuts and sticking yeah so like we more arts so we do we mix our arts and craft with our with black history or our history or with some subjects we just mix it all so we um we used to have like stuff stuck on the wall in genesis Maybe, uh, jesus christ is the breath of life in exodus some, he is the passover lamb Is I actually they got on the drums, got on the piano, and my teacher was like actually listening. Whereas with the other teacher, she was so annoying. I think she might have been racist as well. She really might. Have. Well, right now I'm starting my clothing design, so I'm designing clothes. Like I put down hold for a little bit because I'm learning how to make the different clothes like sewing. So my designs, my designs, my ideas are still like coming from seeing certain uh, clothes or fabrics or something um, but I'm, I'm not like really writing it down or anything but yeah um, well in conclusion I'm in between I have nothing negative to say about homeschooling or school um, like I'm always in between so sometimes I'll be at school and I feel like I'm missing out on certain things at home or I'll be at home and I feel like I'm I'm missing something I'm missing something from um school um so my mom always asks me every year uh do you want to go back to school she asks how the the year has been and I think for year nine I'm gonna be stay home schooled but I'm not sure if year 10 and 11 I might go back to school Bye. Thank you, baby. Kind of a pat up on a priest, and I really want to get you on.